Go. Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's me, Spookle, out here. And, folks, we are here today for another powerful episode of our Pokemon Red and Blue Randomized Soul Link Nuzlocke. And we are not here alone again, folks. As always, we are going to be here with the most powerful of rooms, the controller room. Hello, Spooky Citizens, and hello to my vi uh, my viewers. I hope you all enjoy this episode as we take on Brock, our first gym leader, and probably going to be quite a large challenge for us. I I uh, thank you all again. I uh, thank you all for staying tuned to our series. We we really do appreciate the support. And with that being said, we're just going to go directly into our Pokemon and go through a quick recap. Spooky, you want to go ahead and do that? All right. So as you saw from the grinding, folks, um, it didn't take me long to do much, but still. Uh, I grind both. I ground. I grinded both my Pokemon up to level ten because I figured that'd be a nice little middleman. Because I think Brock's Pokemon are like uh, nine and twelve. I think I, I don't know their exact levels. But either way, we've got Latte uh, here, rocking a powerful twenty-seven defense. That's really cool. Uh, with Tackle and Smog still. So let's just hope no Rock types come out, and we should be fine on that. But then, we've got Lemon Grab here, the Slayer of Dragonites, the Destroyer, uh, rocking a powerful 30 special attack, uh, 21 attack and 21 defense, and with Pound, Hypnosis, Disable, and Confusion, he is ready to go. And in our corner, we have our, uh, corner literally, but now we have uh, Kick It, our Hitmonlee, with a very powerful attack of 31 and a uh, 29, uh, 23 speed. Carry a still with only double kick and meditate, but, that, uh, but that's still plenty enough to take care of most things. He is linked to the uh, he is linked to Hypno, uh, which I forget the name of. Uh, what was it? Lemon Grab. Called? Thank you, Lemon Grab. Yeah, he, he's getting a bit bothered because I keep forgetting his name. Sorry about <laughs> that. Uh, <laughs> then we then we have Metapod, our uh, our, our Metapod uh, SPO that has a uh, 13 defense and uh, 10 attack. I mean, 10 speed, pretty, pretty good, only Harden, but that's a Metapod for you. We're going to go ahead and switch chain him up, hopefully level 10. And with that uh, with that being said, let's go ahead and hit the gym and fight the uh, one guy before Brock. Alright. Fight Elvis. Looks like Elvis to me, at least. Kind of does. Uh, okay. I, I was going to say, do we really need to read it? Like, do we need to no. do a voice raise where I didn't think he's we did? He's a minor character. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh, Paris. Ditto. Oh, uh, well, what I don't know how I feel about that. Could be worse. I mean, he just needs to transform into my coughing, and then I could switch into Hypno. Yeah. In one Got shot. Psychic. It. Psychic in you. Confusion. Boom. Just no, one shot. It. Right I couldn't even afford a potion, though, I realized. You still don't have enough money to buy potions? Nope. Come to think of it, I don't even know if I have potions. E. Maybe before we go to Brock, we see if we can get some potions somehow. Somehow, yeah. We'd have to fight the other guys, but I don't even know if we, I don't even know if it lets us do that far. Yeah, I don't know either. All right, so I'm gonna go for smog. Try to get a poison off. Cause uh, after the coughing, he had a go fairy. Hey, there we go. Crit with the poison. That's what I'm talking about, Latte. He has a manky. Manky! Exactly. Actually, that sounds about right. That sounds like something you'd see in Brock's gym. It does. We're, 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 uh, we're living dangerously at 5 HP, but we do take out the manky. Jesus. Yeah, we, we need to go get you some potions, man. Yeah. Either that, or we need to do another grinding montage, and you need to work on that Metapod. Yeah, get up. That, that's really the that's really the bane of our existence. That's kind of the weak, weakest link in our team, in our soul link. Because that Metapod could fix a lot of situations. Oh, that's true. Especially if it's a butter, if it becomes Butterfree and learns Confusion. Yeah. It covers like. Covers poisoned. Yeah, it covers a lot <laughs> of stuff that you can't hit. Can't hit hard at least. Yeah. And as a flying type, it resists the bug and the grass. It's, it's, 
It would be a perfect counter to our, uh, our uh, enemies starter. Yeah. So I'm gonna stop, go to the mart real quick, see if I have enough to buy even one potion. Cause I'd like to at least have one. Uh, I have enough to buy two. Like you fought all the trainers in the forest, right? Yeah, I did. So yeah, you should have enough to at least buy two. I should, but I don't. Really? Really. That's I weird. must have got low bold, low balled or something like that. It won't even let you go. I won't let you go in to fight the other guys on the uh, path. Until you fight me off. Nope. Jesus. So, uh, where am I at now? Like, I just did fight his, uh, his minion. That's something Same here. So, I guess just go heal up again just to, to be one. safe. Buy that one. Like, right now, anything will help. Yeah. And then whenever you're re I'll be standing in front of him whenever you're ready. Hey, well, you know, I can't sell the town map. You can sell a town map? I cannot sell a town map. Oh. <laughs> I can sell an if I can sell an ether for zero dollars. Damn all that money though. Yeah, no. So I buy I buy one potion and I have thirty dollars left. Jeez. Yeah. I know. Okay, you know what? I'm not even gonna switch chain the metapod. That's what's really getting dangerous for us. We we get hit once for good. So yeah, that's true. I, I think you should switch. We should switch train not on the trainers for the gym leaders at least. Yeah. Well, because you can run away from it or or from the wild at least. Yeah. All right. So whenever you're ready. All right. Yeah. I'm, are you gonna do box boys? Uh, I guess I could. All right. Go ahead. Um, <clears throat> you start now. I'm Brock. I'm Pewter Jim's gym leader. I believe in rock hard defense and determination. That's why my Pokemon are all the rock type. You still want to challenge me? Fine then! Show me your best! Alright. Let's see what I'm you just got, worried Brock. What the is going to be switched into. I don't know, it's similar strength, so we're just gonna have to see. I got a Nidoran female for his first Pokemon. I got a Geodude for his Geodude. <laughs> Damn. Luckily, it's three archetypes, I can only with a double kick. Yeah, just double kick it in the face. It still survives, though. Really? Yep. Jesus. It only, it only hits me with a tackle, but it's more than enough power. And I almost one shot the Nidoran. Nidoran. Well, it's a poison pipe. How do you get all the luck? <laughs> I don't know, like, this game is weird. Like, 80% of what we find is either poison or it's weak to lemon crap. Yeah. And I just gotta start you, so... Okay, his final, his, uh, Onyx got switched to Pidgeotto for me. Wow. Yeah. Okay, better you than me, that's all I have to say about that. Guess I'll go into Latte. Loki, why does Pidgeotto just look like a really fat Pidgey? <laughs> what do you think it is? Really fat pig, uh, pig with a ponytail. <laughs> Alright, we got here, Brock. Oh lord, he's spamming sand attack. Okay, I might have to switch back out. So, what did he, uh, did you ever take out his Geodude yet? Yeah. No, I'm done with him now. Oh, you already are? Yeah. Wait, what did he have for the Onyx? I uh, stir you. Oh. Damn. And now we have Bone Meringue! Whoa, whoa, whoa! Time out here! Time out here! Hold the phone! Back that trolley horse up! Why does this thing have Bone Meringue? No idea. What Pokemon is it? It's a Pidgeotto! <laughs> Why does Pidgeotto have Bone Meringue? What logic is this? No Pokemon! <laughs> it's got Gust and Bone Meringue. It's been spamming on me. Uh, I'm trying. I'm trying to get myself back up to close health, so I'm trying to be careful. Cause I could take a gust, but I don't want to take another bone ring like that. They did a lot of damage. You can see an attack, but I dodge. Pidgeotto, you said. Yeah, Pidgeotto. I'm about to pound this thing in the face. Legit, I just imagine like Lemon Grab missing apparently. Thanks, Lemon Grab. Oh. Why? Okay, is that is that Pidgeotto going to be his uh, Onyx, right? Yeah. 
Alright, well, if you remember, in the first, in pretty much all gens, the TM, uh, the TM move ends up being the move that they know. So I'm guessing that the TM you're gonna get from Glock is Bone Man. Yeah, I'm not mad about that. That's a pretty powerful bone, uh, downside move. Yo, can you please hit this pound on the limit grab? Punch this bird in the face. Uh oh. Bone orang, don't kill. I can play with his tail. Uh oh. That's punishment. Please hit, please hit. Yes! Thank God! 8 HP. Whew, that was close. One more one more turn and I would have been dead. Yeah. And with that, Lemon grabs level 11. Nice. I just realized we randomized nickname. I mean, we randomized the trainer names and his name was Sonya. Huh. <laughs> well, he does have a thing for the ladies. True. Alright, we got the boulder badge. Awesome. Right. And he gave us some some cha ching. Wait, take this with you. Receive TM34. A TM contains a technique a technique that can be taught to Pokemon. A TM is good only once, so when you use one to teach the po a new technique, pick the Pokemon carefully. TM34 contains Boomerang. Well, that was right. What'd you get? Uh, I'll tell you in a second. Yeah, uh, it contains Ember. Bruh. I mean, you could teach it to him on Lee. Let's see, can I teach yeah, this to anyone? Gonna, that's, yeah, that's what I'm gonna do is... Actually, no, I'm not gonna teach it to him on Lee just yet. We're gonna see what we get for the next encounter. Oh, wait, you know why? Because when you normally beat him, it's Bide. So pretty much any, I think any Pokemon can get by back then. So I could teach, I could teach uh, Bonerang. Uh, <laughs> I could teach Bonerang to either Latte or Hypno. That's actually kind of tempting. Yeah. Well then, I think I'm taking a trip to the Pokemon Center. Yeah, so am I. I'm gonna get two potions though first before anything. Two more True. potions. Buy all the potions. I think we have enough time. Well, I don't know if we'll have enough time with the trainer battles too. I was gonna say I think we might have enough time just to get to uh, another counter. Yeah. Well, but maybe. I, it yeah. Depends what they have. You can, we might be able to shoot through them, but you know. Yeah. Legit though, that was funny. I admit, like Pidgeotto with Bulmerang, that just shocked me. Yeah. I'm just happy that I'm just happy Star you didn't get off Ember on us. <laughs> Oh god, that would've been is, horrible. That's when you use uh, a burn on a Pokemon that's just trying to attack you. I mean, burn in general in Gen 1 because all of them are just attacks. True. Alright. Yeah. I'm, I'm gonna get started on the uh, trainers, I guess. Same here. Luckily, a lot of these guys are bug trainers. So. Oh, that's true. So they're gonna have stuff like, Metapo uh, me like uh, Metapods and Magikarps. If I see a magic card, I'm switching in Metapod. I'm switching in my Metapod. Because I know it only has Splash. Caterpie. Tackle. Just spam the tackles. Bonk, bonk, bonk. I, I, I'm just imagining this coughing just like flying full speed at a Caterpie and sending it flying. <laughs> yeah. Hey, he's level 12 now. Uh, Kakuna. I'm about to say, it really doesn't make any difference to me. Double Midrands. Like a boss. <laughs> I actually had one Midrand and one Nidorina. So, That's cool. I had two Midrands, one male, one female, and my bad. Yeah. So. Yeah. Get my. Hit me is going, or hit it is going to be absolutely, or kick it is going to be absolutely ridiculous. Destructive, yeah. I mean, it's carrying all the weight for my team right now. It's an army of one. I mean, that's a that's a good thing and a bad thing in the long run because if you start relying on them too much, it could come in. It could be dangerous. But what can you do right now? Especially against that victory battle that crit us in that one in that first encounter we had. Oh, true. That first battle. Oof, that was terrifying. 
Hey, that's a good reason to have uh, Ember. It is a very good reason to have Ember. Okay, let's do that to fight. Yeah. Go. I'm about to use Mankey. You know what? I'm not even gonna bother switching. He can still get one shot. Why does Mankey look like he's trying to do the YMCA? Because <laughs> he is. <laughs> like he's stuck on the M. He's sec he secretly uh, friends with Hypno, if you know what I mean. Oh, wow. <laughs> I'll take songs that most people don't understand the real meaning for, Alex. <laughs> Pidgey. Silly Pidgey, don't you know you're going to die? Or I hope you are. There we go. Another Pidgey. Lemon grab. Just punch it in the face a few times and then go for confusion. There we go. Alright, I'm gonna run back and heal real quick. Alright. Just, just so I don't have to waste any potions. Yeah. Well, luckily this uh, this guy's dry on Magikarp, so it's uh, free SBO to switch in. Sweet. Just keep getting them levels, man. Just remember, level 12, it gets confusion. Yep. Yep. Forgot you are right there. Honestly, who I'm terrified to fight, I'm terrified to fight Misty, because Misty's going to have Starmie, and that's going to be scary. No, it won't. It's randomized. Well, yeah, it's it's randomized, but Starmie's a pretty powerful Pokemon in this game. Yeah. Yes, it is. And hopefully, like, we won't get, it won't get turned to Gengar, and we'll get one, we'll get killed. Yeah. Well, I mean, you, you can hit it on the poison side, at least. Yeah, but Gengars are fast. You can have speed and get me with, a. Uh, I guess yeah. lick, technically. That's, That's the only thing I can think of. Yeah. Okay, yeah, you're right. Potion. Damn it, Metapod, Probably. stop spamming Harden. Uh, 12 and 12. I, I was looking at what level we got our Metapod up to. Uh, I thought you asked what level you were. Uh, what level were you? I was level 7 going in, but uh, level 8's not too, too bad. Here. That's good. Okay, honestly, if we're going up against like seven metapods, I'm just gonna uh, I'm just gonna spam confusion. Yeah, you know, I, I have an idea after the episode, this suggestion to make this uh, make this episode perhaps a little more approachable. And why does it have to do that? What did it do? Yeah, I heard you just use gust on my hit mom leak. Oh Jesus. Yeah, legit, we need to get you something that's not weak to flying types. Hopefully this next encounter will be that. Yeah. And before it just it turns out to be grass type. Alright, so let's see that. This is a... Well, I gotta write down the route in a sec, so once I finish this training, I'll check what route we're on. I want to say we're on, like, route, we're either route 3 or route 4. Let me see real quick. Item. Uh, what was the town map guy doing? Oh, there it is. Yeah, Route 3. Okay. So, Route 3. There we go. Uh. Alright, so I get the encounter first on this route because you got the Metapod last. Yeah, I'm still I'm still chewing through these uh, these magic carps and everything. All right, I still got one more to go. The, uh, as so happens, you know, Metapod's like super uh, bony. That's why no one ever eats it. <laughs> in the, in the uh, they actually gave a reason why no one eats magic carps. You mean uh, in the anime? Yeah. Yeah, I remember that. It's it, it actually fun fact. That's what normal carps are too. That's why a lot of people don't like to eat normal carps. Because they're uh, they got too many little bones in them. 
And I mean, honestly, do you really want to mess with the? You might you might come after uh, come at a magic card with a knife, and it would be forcing you to evolve, uh, evolving, and then you're dead. Oh, true. <laughs> That'd be terrifying. You really think about it, I think Magikarp's like the first ever real troll Pokemon. <laughs> True. It's like, I suck. No, actually I don't. If you take the time to level me up and take time to switch chain me, then I'm probably You know what out. I just thought of? What? There's a uh, gift Pokemon we can get on this route that should be randomized. Which Pokemon is that? Oh, isn't it like a Jinx or something in the, uh, right by Moon? No, no, in Mount- in the Pokemon Center next to Mount Moon. We can buy yeah. a Magikarp from the guy for 500. Po for 500, it'll be randomized to something else. This is very good. That's that's uh, two encounters before moon. Okay. All right. So route three, my encounter is a Machoke. Not bad at all. A nice fighting type. Can't use it, but Machoke is like looking at me funny. Like one eye is missing a pupil here. Well. Well, I'll be this as fast as I can. Take your but time. Yeah, like, oh, like I said, I have a uh, have an idea for the episode, so don't worry if it goes a little long. Cause it, actually, if we do this idea, then it, it won't even matter. I was thinking maybe we want to uh, use the fast boy option when we go through these battles. It's kind of like an in an in uh, episode grind, but that's so people don't have to sit and watch us go through these yeah, battles. Yeah, fair enough. Uh, and then that that'll take like ten minutes out of the episode, so we can be a little more liberal with the time. Yeah. Come on. I had to do that. I actually had to do that on my uh, Leaf Green Nuzlocke. Cause I had, I had a, uh, I had, I, I actually, uh, my story was a uh, story of me, and uh, <laughs> and uh, I, I came up against a Shininja, and uh, oh, actually I'm the exact same route. I'm the exact same guy I'm battling right now. Actually, he had a Shininja, and I, I had to keep uh, going yeah. after him until he, uh, until he struggled himself out. Uh, we might be in trouble here. Why? Cause I accidentally poisoned him a choke, and he won't stay in the ball. Well, you better get it next ball. I got one last chance. Cross your fingers here. Send some, send Spooky some shiny luck, everyone. Or shiny luck. Send him some cat yes, luck. Yes, got it. Oh, power. Yeah. Uh, one more turn. I think it has maybe two HP left. God damn, that's wow. luck. Oh All right. crap! Oh crap! Oh crap! What's wrong? Do you have an antidote? What? You have an antidote because it's gonna go to you. It, you don't have six Pokemon yet, so it's gonna go to your belt, and when you move, it's going to die. I have antidote, so ah, but I forgot to nickname it. Oh well, I, I'll just have to. Whenever we get to the name later, I'll have to nickname okay. it. But I got antidote, don't worry. That's I'm what prepared. I was asking. Like, if you don't have antidote, that that's gonna, the worst troll ever. You're gonna take one step, it's going to die. <laughs> oh, it's legit at one HP. Damn, Latte, you know how to be evil. Well, you're using that humongous poison gas bag. What do you expect? <laughs> Alright, so once I get to the po I'll wait at the Pokemon Center for you. Uh, okay. Once I get there, I'll box him since we can't really use him because of Hitmonlee. Yeah. Oh, that's right, that's right. Yeah. Tackle. You can peck all you want, buddy. I have a powerhouse on my yeah. side. Go ahead and peck him to stay away from me with a bug type and a fighting type. Don't peck me. <laughs> I'm, I don't like being pecked. Is never a fun time. Now, now I have a spear I'm up against. Ooh. Luckily, it's partially normal type, and I'm faster than it is. So maybe we get it off a get double get a double kick to take it out. True. So are you gonna are you gonna name that thing Hulk Hogan, or what are you gonna name it when you actually get the? Uh, uh probably. Normally, when I whenever I get a Machope, I name it after. I'm a choke. Anything from, from the Machop line, I name it after, uh... I name it Steve. For some weird, weird reason. I like... I, it started whenever I did my Alpha Sapphire Nuzlocke on the channel. Which is the first ever Nuzlocke I actually, like, won. Uh, okay. Yeah, he was kind of a last-minute addition to the team against the Elite Four. This is not good. What's wrong? I just, I just, I'm switch chaining my uh, Espio against like Magic or something like that. Coming to this guy, this guy actually has a level 14 Pidgey, and now oh I'm boy. stuck. Oh, Sand Attack! Thank you. Oh, thank, thank God. You for the sand just attack. don't miss. Yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna heal. At least I'm pretty sure there's a guy here who I'll, add, I'll look around and see. I think you. Yeah, I, I think you're right. 
Because I don't know if that was just in like the uh, remake. No, no, I think you're right. I think you're right. I think you're... okay. Yeah, I think you're right. Let's see. Oh, you piece of crap. Okay. Okay. You? Oh. Yeah, I found him. I, I'm getting I'm getting too old for this crap. <laughs> <laughs> so so the, the dude sand attacks me. So now my accuracy is low, and I know that, right? Yeah. Then I don't take him out in the first double kick uh, series, so it means I have to go to the second double kick series, right? Yeah. And then he's faster, so he hits Gust. Drops us, drops us down to what? Okay, so he gets a free hit on us. Then we, uh, then on turn two, he gets a Gust on us. Then turn three, when I'm about to finish him off, you know what the dude does? What? Quick attack. Wait, did he kill him on No, no, he's still alive by four HP. But I'm, I said I'm getting too old oh, for this crap. Thank you, God. <laughs> <laughs> like I, I felt my heart stop when you said he had quick attack. Yeah, four HP. If that thing was a crit, because that thing was faster than us, so the crit chance was higher. True. Legit. Okay. That's terrifying. So far, I'm the only one that's lost the Pokemon for us. So. And I, I can't lose that, not unless I have something to attack with. Because right. we would have lost the lock then, also. Yeah, that's true. So whatever I get, I don't care what it is, like, I honestly, I just want something to do a tap with, that's all I'm asking. As long as it's not a fighting type. Um, one sec, I'm sorry, I have to run some real quick. Give me a moment, it only takes two seconds, I'm sorry. Oh, uh, that's cool. Sorry about that, folks. I had to run something to the other room real quick. Uh, did you get your encounter? Uh, not yet. I'm fighting the last guy before oh. I get out there. Alright. Yes, luckily it's a Metapod. No pitches for him. <laughs> At least not the first one, but I'm not going to be switching back into Metapod, especially unless I see it like a Magikarp or something like that. Now I will. But, uh, I'm not going to be obviously switching if he has a flying type. It's just make no sense. Exactly. But he's just hardening and making me waste all these double kicks. Luckily, there's 30 of them, so. <laughs> yeah, that's good. It's a good thing you got, like, pretty much the, ta the fighting form of tackle. Yeah. The f well, and I more mean, powerful as well. Yeah, true. Kakuna. Well, I'm not gonna switch out because I want to be poisoned. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so Wow, this Kakuna has more defense than that Metapod without even hardening. Jeez. That being said, even if, even if we do go through that 10 minutes, like, yeah. Yeah, that's true. It's going to be a little longer. Uh, you, what you're going to have to do is you're going to do some fancy editing for yours, I, th I feel like. But you can't even do that. That's the issue. Oops. Yeah, because we're like on, actually we're at 29 minutes. Yeah. So yeah, um, pretty... we're going to have to cut something out. But even if we do the fast forward through the, uh, through the encounter, or through the uh, battles, that's going to save a little time. But the thing is, you got your encounter before I did. I mean, had you stayed on the encounter screen, that would have been something, but you, you capped it, which is fine, just it makes uh, it a little difficult. Uh, we'll, well, figure, we'll figure something out. Beautiful, Butterfree is about, oh, it's a Valve new Butterfree now. Sweet, now all it needs is two more, it needs is two more levels to get confusion. Yeah, two more levels. That's all we need to Alright. So I'm going for my encounter now, in this route. I'm having a battle with this girl, I'm gonna leave her there because we're already on a time crunch. Yeah. Just hit the just get to the encounter and if you want we can get to the uh you can get to the Pokemon Center and we can get the magic card. Alright. So Pidgey. It was a Pidgey for me. It was a Pidgey for you? Alright, you can catch it. We can't so that's a normal fighting type. Is it? Yeah, it would be. Normal flying, or is it flying normal? I mean that's uh, I'm pretty sure it's normal flying. 
Yeah, because there's, there's no prime. The, there's only like one primary flying type. And the like right now, and I can't think of what it is off the top of my head. All right, well I'm I'm keeping Butterfree in only because I don't want to switch and get gusted out and die. And... I mean it's bad because I know you have uh, Latte, but I just don't want to uh, don't want to take that type of risk. Yeah, I understand completely. Wow, stay in the ball, my Pidgey friend. I have two balls left. You better stay in this the, the, one of these two. Okay, there we then. go. Nope, he's not staying in there. Balls. Jeez. And he decided to break through all my balls. Well, kill all right. it. Right. Time, time, to, time to run. I'm not even gonna risk it. I'm just gonna run from it. So, all right. yeah. Cross I mean, that it, off. Technically, you didn't, you didn't nickname it either, so, I mean, it's not good, but it's not. Alright, I'll, um, I'll put it, I'll move the Machop to box 12. Alright, I didn't even catch the thing, because why? Uh, or I didn't even uh, kill it, because there's no point. Uh, okay, yeah. so, here we are, we're in here, let's actually go ahead and heal up, and then, uh, to end the episode. Well, we can't actually get the Magikarp. We can't get the Magikarp? We can. That's what I'm saying is... Yeah. Actually, let's let's do that in the next episode. Let's, uh, you want to do that? You want to see it for the next episode? All right. Something to something to think about. Yeah. All right. So uh, it's your channel, yeah. Right? All right. Yeah. Thing. It's my it's my episode, so I'll right. cut it off. All right, folks. So we had some fun today. We took down our first gym leader. That was pretty good, if you ask me. Um, I can't wait to see what that magic card is. I'm gonna be honest. But anyway, folks, if you did enjoy this video, make sure you go swipe that like button. It shows you appreciate the content and you want to support these channels. And folks, make sure you also go check out Mr. TCR's channel in the description. He does a lot of cool other uh, LPs and stuff also. And uh, yeah, so other than that, I think it's time we say goodbye. I'm Spookalai. I'm TCR. And we'll see you all in the next video. Stay spooky, folks.